So, uh, good morning all of you. In the last video, we discussed the wave function uh, and uh, energy for an electron. Uh, if, buy, if the electron is bound in a one dimensional potential box, that means that electron is free to move only in one dimension. Okay? Uh, and uh, so, how to, so, last class we discussed the wave function and also the energy of the ele uh, that electron when the electron is in ground state or first energy state or second energy state, something like that. But, uh, how to calculate the momentum of the electron? So, how to calculate the position of the electron? So, let us see. So, if electron is found in a one dimensional box of length 0 to a, that means this electron is free to move only in one dimensional box and the box height is infinite. The box height is infinite. Infinite. Okay. So, next. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
के a square के इधर रहता है outside and sine pi x by a sine pi x by a sine square pi x divided by a into dx so how to integrate this uh, integral term so here we are getting sine square so we know that the trigonometric uh, relations uh, cos 2 theta is equal to 1 minus 2 sine square theta and uh, so interchange these two terms so then we get uh, 2 sine square theta is equal to 1 minus cos 2 theta right and so therefore sine square theta is equal to 1 by 2 into 1 minus cos 2 theta so put the value of uh, the, the sine square value here so then we get a square a square integration 0 to a sin square means 1 by 2 into 1 minus cos 2 theta means pi x square value into dx into dx right so next So, parameters we can be written as dx is equal to 1, right? And a square integration 0 to a, uh, 1 by 2 to take the a, that 1 by 2 is outside, and uh, to take differential uh, integral is dx minus cos 2 pi x divided by a into dx.
therefore x into sin square means 1 by 2 into 1 minus cos 2 theta means pi x by a so here I am going to take n is equal to 1 because here I am going to discuss a particle bound in a ground state so 2 pi x divided by a okay 2 pi x divided by a dx why because 2 uh, 2 into theta theta means pi x by a so next is equal to 2 by a integration 0 to a x take this 2 outside 2 uh, x multiply this x inside into dx minus integration 0 to a x into cos 2 pi x divided by a into dx okay so next is equal to 2 to cancel 1 by a into integration of x x square by 2 limit varies from 0 to a minus so integration by parts okay so that is c uh, put x as it is like uh, here and integrate this one so that uh, integration of cos sin 2 pi x divided by a into for the coefficient divided by 2 pi a so that is what I am going to write this as uh, a by 2 pi minus differentiation of first term x differentiation of x 1 okay integration of uh, this uh, second term sin so integration of sin means cos minus cos cos 2 pi x divided by a into a coefficient a by 2 pi a by 2 pi we are already going to go another a by 2 pi is there so multiply that a by 2 pi into a by 2 pi whole square so 0 to a limits next is equal to 1 by a into 1 by a into so put the value of uh, put the limits here and you get a square by 2 minus uh, if you put a here so then you get a a a gets cancelled sin 2 pi sin 2 pi means uh, e1 pi so it will be 0 right this whole term will be 0 for upper limit and lower limit so next to minus uh, uh, minus into minus plus so plus so if you put the value here after applying the limit you get cos a is cos 2 pi minus cos 0 cos 0 of a by 2 pi whole square but we know that uh, cos any pi e1 pi is 1 and the cos 0 is also 1 so 1 minus 1 0 right 1 minus 1 is 0 so therefore the value of this integral is 1 by a into 1 by a into a square by 2 a square by 2 Okay, so next expectation value of x is equal to uh, 1 by a into a square by 2. So a square a gets cancelled. Remaining this expectation value of x is equal to a by 2. A by 2. That means if an electron bound in a bonding box, if it is in ground state, the possibility of get an electron in this a by 2, 0 to a, a by 2 means this position. So the probability of getting the electron in this position is more. So we know that we observe that wave function will be like this for a 1D pulse. So if the wave function is maximum, the probability of getting the particle in the position is also more, maximum, right? So the probability of getting the charge, getting the particle in this position is more in a 1D box. The probability of getting the electron in the center is more. So, if you have a calculator, you can electron the e position. You can use the electron in the center. So, we so, so, are so, getting average value. So, that is average value is not equal to expression value of x. Okay? So, the probability of getting the particle uh, like electron in a 1D box is a by 2. That means, in this position, the maximum for, uh, probability of getting the particle. So, this is the just the answer to the electron and the condemnation will move on better. Okay? So, the expectation value of x, so I am going to repeat it once again. So, first expectation value of x is equal to integration psi star a psi. Psi means wave function. Wave function for this electron that is psi is equal to a psi pi x divided by a. 
and the size star means size star is also is equal to a sin pi x divided by a. But the first so, so we have to calculate the value of a. That means we have to normalize the wave function. How to normalize the wave function? Normalize wave function means integration sin star sin dx is equal to one. So there you get the value of a. And again we have to put the value of a here and this wave function is subtract here. So the normalized wave function is sin is equal to root 2 pi a into sin pi x divided by l or pi x divided by a. So this is the normalized wave function. So this wave function you have to put here. Otherwise we have to go to uh, normalize from the center. Okay. So now first normalize modding here. So you need to start from the normalized modding. So we first normalize the wave function subtract model. So no need to normalize the wave function. Okay, next, in the next video, I will discuss uh, momentum. Momentum P. Expression left momentum. P.